guys, welcome back to Anne's, and I am high key, very excited for this video. So I have this major obsession with Stranger Things. I love the cast, the show, it's just everything about it I love. And I was thinking that since Christmas is right around the corner, that I would show you three different Stranger Things t-shirt ideas for Christmas, birthdays, anything for just regular gifts, you know, uh, for people who are obsessed or who love Stranger Things like me. I am written. In reality, I really just made this video because I wanted to have an excuse to make the shirts for myself because, like I said, I'm obsessed, but, you know, I thought I would share it with you guys so you could see and have some ideas of what you would want your shirts to look like. Uh, yeah. So, the reason I say I'm obsessed with Shooter Things is because I made a poem for them for my English class. Uh, it's on my <laughs> Instagram, one I'm biological sister. You can check them out. I And I also baked a cake for them for a cake class that I did. And now I have made Shooter Things shirts. And I am so happy and thrilled with how they came out. I love them so much. I think my personal fave is probably the long sleeve gray one. You'll see what I'm talking about. Um, but yeah, all these shirts are using transfer paper. They're super easy and it, it's it's affordable as well and i really hope you guys enjoy this video there was one slight uh, mishap i was supposed to use dark transfer paper instead of light transfer paper um so you'll see how that turns out and i kind of left it i left it in the video to kind of show you guys what not to do so yeah anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified every time i upload a new video and if you do end up creating or making any shirts for, of your own definitely tag me in them and send me the pics because i would love to see how much you guys came up with and if you haven't noticed i cut my hair and i'm in a kind of different place i am currently in england visiting my sister for um christmas and this is why i kind of in a uh, sort of new setup i'm in her room yeah, so I, I am vlogging this trip because, you know, it's an annual thing for when I go away, I vlog. So that video, or those videos, haven't I haven't decided how I'm going to upload them. It will be coming out soon, so definitely check that out when that comes out. And without further ado, let's just get on into the video. The first shirt that we are going to start with is a Friends Don't Lie shirt. I searched up Stranger Things Friends Don't Lie design and found one that I liked and printed it out based on my transfer paper instructions. Most transfer paper says to print out the image or words backwards, so that's what I did. Just follow your paper's instructions. After I printed off the design I wanted, I cut it down to size and began to iron it based on the instructions. When I was finished, I peeled off the paper, and this is my finished product. I did all of these steps for the other shirts. For the babysitting shirt though, it was hard to find a picture without the background, but if you use a gray shirt like I did, it isn't very noticeable, so it works out. Stranger Things shirt using the iconic logo. If you use black or other dark colored shirts, be sure to use transfer paper that is specifically for dark clothes. Otherwise, you end up with this. <laughs> it still looks pretty good, but of course it could be better. Either way, I still love how it turned out. Uh, yeah, and that's the finished product. So definitely hit me up so um, we can share our love for Stranger Things. Uh, so I hope to see you next Sunday for uh, another <laughs> Yarns video. And I'm so sorry for not posting for a couple of weeks. But I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will see you next week. Bye!